Just before the accident, I felt something break. The wheels went away. I came to in a lake. The sky did not look right to me. The moon was upside down. Schools of shiny fish. When I'm writing this music for Speakeasy, I'm thinking about Duke Ellington, and I'm thinking about Cab Calloway, and how I've listened to this music for years and years, and I've never done anything like it, or even tried to get into that world, and it's so much fun. Just knowing that it's a really physical form of music, and it's going to find its, its, its final like, manifestation in a physical movement changes the whole world. Game. I did work when I lived in France uh, for six years with um, it was not a dance company it was more it was a theater group it it really uh, helped me to to figure out in a more uh, practical way intuitions I had about music about um, what creates dynamic into in a musical discourse you know what what creates momentum what creates drama and the dance, dance or acting and the music in it uh, actually, um, instead of really like just on, from a music point of view, uh, getting out of your own medium to answer uh, what's, what someone else is doing through another medium, uh, just uh, makes you going out of what you know already, what you do already. And, um, and go towards like a, dig further into the expression. Art is a stain on silence. It's a, a wrinkle in nothing. It's just something that happens that ruins a nice, tidy emptiness. It's entropy, and hopefully it's controlled entropy. It's ruining something, but as well as we possibly can, in a way that hopefully makes it worth the trouble of even being here. That's art. <laughs>